Hi everyone, James here. This is update number one of the 135th scale Tacon King Tiger SD KFZ 182 Porsche turret with the Zimmer included. So, steps one, two, seven is the assembly of the lower hull with the various components and step 7 is where I'm at is the front zimmer panel and the the draft sprockets. And this is the progress. So with this I'm going to paint the interior at the same time as I build as I go along. It's gonna be difficult to get in there after all the uh, the other components are in. And I do now have an air, airbrush, so it's going to make it a bit easier to paint. So that's the progress so far. Very happy, everything fits together nice and snug. No flash. Excellent detail too. Back again, made the suspension torsion bars, section 7, made 8 of the, the small ones and then 10 of the, the outer long ones, and then 8 to 11 is the, the placement of the torsion bars, adding the road wheels. Then building the lower hull escape hatch underneath, adding more interior components. That's where I've got up to so far, and this is the results. It's now been red oxide primed. So this is the progress so far, the row wheels and the dry sprockets are on. It's the, uh, the lower escape hatch. It's the interior parts.
steps 26 to 29 have now been assembled. That's the ancillary hoses, some more plating for the engine bay, and the various other parts. Also, there are the radiators and more various parts. And this is the progress so far. This is the lower hull. It's been airbrushed in the the wrought brown. It's the reddish brown colour. The, the red oxide primer. If it will focus, that's the one I use for that. And then. For the engine and a few other parts inside the lower hull, I use the grey base. And then for the off cream, I use the cream device. I did also weather a few parts here and there to give it that used worn look. With some oil staining and very staining and and foot traffic. That's the parts added to the back. In, in the engine bay, a few staining and weathering, weathered panels, and then I still need to touch the up the gear box. That needs to be painted in the the greenish colour for gearboxes. That is the, it's the bright green. This is the engine all been airbrushed and hand brushed also. Uh, as you can see, I have uh, weathered it also. And then the, the radiators, the ancillary hoses, and uh, various other parts. <coughs> 